Hello, our citizens. My name is Chris. I'm a brand education instructor from Rolling Hills, California. And thank you for joining me again for our five element Qigong series. This is the fourth element. This is fire. We've already done our metal, our water, our wood. And so thank you for joining me here for fire. So let's bring our feet about shoulder width apart. So fire element has to do with our heart. So you may start to rub the center of your heart. Good. So you want to bring the focus in. So we want to set the intention by knowing where we're working, what we're trying to clean. So we're going to purify. We're going to cleanse a little bit. We're going to build and then we're going to circulate and cultivate and grow the energy we want. Good. The other organ is our small intestines. So coming down, you can rub right in the middle, right around the belly button area. Good. Kind of a smaller circle so you're not getting too wide. So right there, central. So the heart and the small intestines are related together for the fire element. Good. So now that we've got our mind into those two areas, we're going to start to do a little bit of our Tai Chi opening to get the energy flowing. So inhaling up and exhaling down. So feel the energy come up your spine, down your spine. Good. I want you to lift your heart, drop your tailbone, exhale, tuck your tailbone, sink your chest. Inhaling up. We want to start to connect the mind, the body through the breath. Let's get a little bit of a rhythm and a flow. So when the fire energy is a little too hot, we tend to have a little bit of possibly hate, a little bit of even uh, real severe frustration. So we want to be able to clean through some of that. So inhaling up and down one more time. And exhale. So now I'd like to make a giant energy ball. So my hand is cradling my small intestines and it's covering my heart. So I've got both of my fire uh, organs inside my energy ball. So we're going to start to release here a little bit. So as we go, we're going to spin this energy ball. So see it spin in my hands. I'm going to lift my left hand up. I'm going to push my right hand out. Good. So I'm going to give you a little bit of cue. So then we're going to grab that energy ball, dropping the hand, and we're going to twist back to the other side. So as I get to the center, I'm going to start to spin again, inhaling up and pushing. So now to help you remember where we're going, gather that energy ball. So the energy of our heart, the fire in our heart, we are going to open the window and we're going to push all the frustration out of our heart and let it go. Gather. So the first part of the meridian for the heart is in our armpit. So you open it and you shove all the anger out, all the hate out, coming back, spiraling and pushing. So you can inhale to the middle, exhale, release. Gather the energy ball, coming back to the center, lifting, exhale. Push all the hate, all the venom out through your armpit. So using that firm breath allows you to purge, to purify, to release more and more of the energy we don't want, the energy that's not harmonious, the energy that's causing us trouble. Exhale. One more time. Now, as we come to our holding posture, we're going to bring our elbows up level with our shoulders. We're going to open our hands. So imagine you're holding a giant chalice. Your hands are holding the cup, offering it up. Let the fire evaporate. Elbows are level with your shoulders. Relax the shoulders here. So now, this might be a little challenging on the shoulders. It might cause a little bit of tension, but we want to help to open that energy. So you're offering this fire, this hate up to the universe to help it purify. So through our holding posture, this is how we build our energy. So you learn to hold these a little bit longer, a little bit longer, and you're able to create new energy, to have the materials to work with. 
So we've let go of a lot of the hate. Now we're growing our energy so that we can grow and cultivate our joy, our happiness. That's the energy of the heart. When a heart is harmonious, there's joy and happiness. Good. Embrace the vibration, the discomfort. Allow it to ah, heal your body. Good job. Now we're going to slowly let our arms hang. I'm going to let you clean them a little bit. Let them hang. Give a little shake. Good. Then we're going to bring our hands up like we're hugging the giant tree. Good. Now with your right hand, go and push it down. Good. So I'm sending energy into my heart. I'm pulling energy from the earth. I'm going to inhale. I'm going to turn over to the left side. And then I'm going to switch my hands. I'm going to slide away. And then I'm going to turn. Switching my hands. So I can inhale one way. Exhale the other way. The top hand is delivering new, fresh energy to your heart. The bottom hand is pulling some energy from the earth, helping you to recharge and refresh. See beautiful red energy, filling your heart, joy, happiness, expanding inside. So through this flow, I feel like I'm expanding my energy. I'm growing that joy. I picture myself happier. I feel the bright red energy filling my heart. Good. One more to each side. Coming back to the center. I'm going to bring down the energy three times. Feel it harmonize, smooth out energy throughout your whole body. Last one. Clasping the hands. Bring your feet a little closer together. And swaying in the boots. Bamboo, drifting. No effort. Let the energy move. Feel the lightness, the joy inside the heart. You may even visualize a smile inside the heart that creeps up onto your face. Job. Now start to circle your abdomen. Bring your feet a little bit wider, consolidating that energy into your lower abdomen, your lower dungeon that serves as the foundation for all the energy in our body, supporting all five elements. Good job. Come into your dungeon. Deep breath in and out. Good. Thank you for joining me on this uh, work with our fire element to help us create more joy, to get rid of a little bit of hate and harmonize that energy inside our body. So thank you for joining. If you would like to experience a full one hour brain education based class, please contact the Body and Brain Center near you.